Good evening, guys. Good evening. Give me just one second, please, that I, I need to fix something with my camera. Ouch. There I am. Yeah, I was worried. I couldn't see myself. Hello, hello, good evening. Hello, hello, good evening, teacher. I could have sworn there was somebody else. Podría jurar que había alguien más con nosotros. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we are okay here. Hello, Eric. How are you? Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. And tell me, how's everything? ¿Qué tal todo? And I'm fine, teacher. I'm fine. Uh, you relax in the in the work. At work. At work. Okay. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. Yeah, we are in the middle of the week, right? Vamos a media semana. Sometimes the middle of the week is kind of hard, right? A veces se siente duro. For me, for me, Wednesdays, you know, are the hardest, are the most difficult. The rest of the week, I'm like, cool, no problem. But Wednesdays, I'm like, oh my gosh. Thursday are okay. Eddie. Hmm. I guess you're having a little hola, problem hola. connection, Hello, right? Uh, tengo... cámara, tal vez. Yep, yep. Do that. Yes. yes, sometimes that affects. A veces eso afecta. What about now? Can you hear me okay? Yes, yes. Okay, okay. Well, Eric, it's a pleasure to have you here and welcome to the class. Thank you. Claudia. Hello, Claudia. How are you? Good evening. Hello, hi. I am How, okay. You are okay? Come on, Claudia. Okay, no, you must be perfect. Great. Okay, it's like, uh, yeah, you know. Come on, Claudia. Tell me, how was your day? What did you do today? I, I work. <laughs> I work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome to the club, my dear Claudia. Bienvenido al club. That's normal. <laughs> All of us were in the same situation, I guess. Thank I you. guess there was just one of your classmates that I remember told me, I don't know if it was today or yesterday. No, you had yesterday your day off, right? Oh, hola. <laughs> when do you have your day off? ¿Cuándo que tiene su día libre? On Sunday. On Sunday, just Sunday. Mm -hmm. Sí, yes. Yeah, but if you are a mother, there's no day off. Si es madre, no hay día libre. Ah, uh, right? sí. I mean, it's the truth. There's no day off when we are like that. Okay, okay. Well, Claudia, a pleasure to have you here.
Okay, well, 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 well. Let's hope you don't have problems, guys. Some people is reporting problems because of the rain. It's raining in some mm. places. <laughs> and that's giving problems even with the connection. So let's hope we don't have that problem. So that's bad. That's pretty bad. Okay, well, Claudia, nice having you here. Thank you and welcome. Thank you. Nilton, hello, Nilton, how are you? Hi, teacher. Um, I am good. Um, okay, how was your day? Good day. Bien. Hoy salió todo como se esperaba. <laughs> oh, everything went as planned. Let me text it for you. Okay. ¿Cómo? No escuché bien. Everything. ¿Cómo? Everything. Everything. Came out. Came out. As planned. Ok, se me cortó un poquito, dicho. Yo creo que es mi internet, ya voy a revisar. Everything came out as planned. Ah, uh, everything came out planned. Ok. Yeah, that's cool. That's great. I mean, when you have the, the, the chance to get everything correct, it's great. Because yeah. sometimes they, some days are like crazy, right? I'm going to do some hectic. I Ayer. Mean, Ayer fue fatal. That... Estaba, bien, estaba viendo el tema de los accidentes y cosas así. Ayer fue un día trágico, la verdad. Yeah, yesterday was a bad day. A very bad day. Yeah, I totally understand you, my friend. But let's hope everything goes okay today. Pero no todo vaya bien ahora. And yeah, people can finish their day like peacefully. Yeah, because it's it's complex. It's actually very complex. Nilton, welcome to the class. Nice having you here. Okay, thank you. Ruth, hello, Ruth. How are you? I guess Ruth is busy. Mm -hmm. Julio, how you doing, Julio? You doing better? No, yes, I have a, a little better than yesterday. You feel a little better. Okay, that's nice. That's actually nice. Because, I mean, yesterday I know you were suffering, right? Yes. But it's good. It's good that the fact that you are feeling better, that you are okay, because some days are like very bad, right? Algunos días son muy malos, and and particularly when you are sick, man, it's terrible. Más cuando uno está enfermo. So you're taking your medicines and stuff. Mm, yes. Yeah, because that's really yes. important. Man, this thing's gonna act up tonight. Creo que hoy vamos a tener lío con el Zoom. I don't know if it's just me. No sé si soy solo yo. Um, algo se corta. corta. Yeah, but I mean, the it's... Uh... Let's see. It's just that everything. I mean, the problem sometimes is the 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 bandwidth, el ancho de banda, and when when it starts raining, it gets like that. Y cuando comienzan las lluvias, it gets crazy. Internet connection gets chaotic, right? 
But good thing is that for the moment we are here. That's what matter. Julio, welcome to the class. Thanks. No, thanks to you. So, lady, hello. Hi, teacher. How are you? A uh, little sad. Sad? Yes. Can I ask you why? Melancholic. Melancholic? How come? Mm Why? Why melancholic, my dear? Por qué melancólica? Tell me. Um, a veces, sometimes I miss my family. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you stay the whole week there, right? Yeah. How regularly do you come back to your family? Uh, once a month. Sometimes. Once? Uh, once more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Most well, I know it is hard. I know. I know. I understand you totally. Yo lo entiendo perfectamente. That that happened to me. I mean, first when I was working in in San Pablo Tacachico, and I was working there for a couple of months. Then I went to Chiltipan for years. And it was hard. Sometimes sometimes mm -hmm. I was coming home like once every two weeks or a month. And the problem was my son was a little boy at that time. So it's hard. I understand you. But, you know, I mean, eh, that's the way life is. We need to adapt. We need to overcome. You need to find something. I mean, the, the biggest problem is when you don't have your mind busy. If you keep your mind busy, I mean, you are like so occupied that you don't realize when the day is gone and you are tired, you just fall asleep. But it's hard when you get free time, right? That's when it hits harder. Yeah, usually I always very busy uh, work uh, gym class english class um, but sometimes you got mm -hmm. a few minutes and then your mind starts like going around and around right mm -hmm. sometimes rarely rarely uh, rarely but sometimes I feel alone. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I understand you. I understand you. And so you're renting a house, a room, or or what? Where do you live there? Um, alone. So you're renting a house? Yes, yes. Okay. In my case, it was different because I was I was renting just one room. It was a house, and in the house there was there was just a, a couple. They were a couple of they were very old people, so it was nice because we could talk, we could have fun, and I mean I wasn't like completely alone. I mean, I was just alone the moment that I was going to, to sleep. But uh, most of the time I was at the at my workplace. And I had the incentive that uh, I I was working with some um, Americans. So I had the chance to, to practice and, and that helped me a lot. 
But no. don't worry, don't worry. <laughs> it happens, it happens. And it passes. Así como viene pasa. So, take it easy. You don't have Thank kids, you. right? <laughs> no, no tiene niños. No. Okay, that's then it's not a problem. No a husband, <laughs> no marriage. Ah, yeah. even better. <laughs> yeah, everything. Nothing, nothing. <laughs> everything's cool. That's all yeah. Fine. Don't worry. I mean, that's <laughs> fine. Yeah, it's different when when you got that type of responsibilities because you know a family is a responsibility. Mm -hmm. when you have that type of responsibility yeah it's different it's a completely different situation and yeah. you need to adapt to that situation but like this nah, don't worry piece of cake <laughs> and you are young how old are you how old are you 26 oh my gosh you're a little kid of yeah, that's fine. Actually, I was, I was your age. Yeah, I was your age when I was living over there. Yeah, as I told you, as I told you, I understand you completely, but it passes, it passes. It's just for moments. For moments, yeah. yeah. Well, lady, nice talking to you. Welcome. Thank you. You know, Veronica Elizabeth, I got a problem with you. Serious problem. Oh my God. Good evening, teacher. I'm yeah. sorry, but I I catch uh, a call. Oh, really? I caught. I caught. I, okay, I caught. It's in past. Yes. It goes like this. Look, I caught. Yes. Uh-huh. Yes, I caught. Uh, oh, cold. 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 Yeah, cold. you know, cold. the problem right now I got with you is that you got me envious, so medio envidia, so. Oh, no, no. <laughs> I got my cup of coffee I have ready. Tea, tea, for, tea for my throat. Tea. You know, whenever I get the sorter, I get ice cream. Man, that's cool. No. I had to visit the doctor. I went to the doctor. And how did it go? ¿Qué dijo el médico? I I had a cold and I had uh, inflamado, no sé cómo se Swollen, swollen. Okay. Y uh, she gave me the medicines and she inject in, inject injects. Oh really? Yes. Ouch, that's bad. That was yeah. But I am. Yeah, because I, I don't, I don't, <laughs> I don't sure like those not. things. I don't like those things. I mean, almost an injection. I hate them. <laughs> uh, I'm a crybaby for those things. I'm a crybaby. Yo soy yo I mean, I believe so. me. All right. men are. No, 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 no. I know. All men are like that thing. I know some guys that they are like, ah, eh, cool, no problem. But me, man, <laughs> I'm like, oh my gosh, no, I get like, I get nervous, you know, I get the shakes and I get like, <laughs> it's terrible. I got a phobia for those things. It's horrible whenever they're going to do that. I mean, uh, terrible, terrible. What, whenever I go to the doctor, if the medicine can be in a in a in a in a pill, I rather have a pill and not an injection. <laughs> Doesn't matter. A hundred pills, perfect. No injection. But the injection is more is more quick. It's quicker. It's quicker. Doesn't matter to me. No problem. I can <laughs> I can wait. Yo espero. No problem. But no injections. No way, Jose. Yeah, mm -hmm. those things are not. I mean, those things and me, we got a serious problem. Tenemos un serio problema. We have a serious disagreement. Injections and me. Yeah. 
Because, man, those things scare me. Yeah, I'll be honest with you. They scare me a lot. I don't know how people... I mean, there are some people that like, my dad, my dad is like, whenever he's sick, he always asks the doctor, can I have that on an injection? If the doctor says yes, he's happy. Man, I'm the, I'm exactly the opposite. Uh. <laughs> yeah, for me, it's like, no way, Jose. I don't like those things. They are not done for me. Yeah. Well, Veronica, let's hope you get better. You know, you can blame it on, on Julio. Where is Julio? Julio, 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 Julio. Oh, there's Julio. You can blame me on Julio. Mm -hmm. Julio se lo contagio. Yeah. yeah. You can blame me to your classmate because he was very sick yesterday. Yesterday, be, be, yesterday because he, yesterday he, he who was saying my in my group. Yeah, yes, there, <laughs> you see, you got it there. That's, yeah, yeah, that's the way yeah. you got it. Hey, Veronica, nice having you here. Welcome. Okay, thank you, teacher. Hey guys, let me get the attendance, please. Uh, Ana Marlene Andrade de Osorio. Present teacher. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. And Carlos Miguel Umaña Lobo. Present. Lelia Estela Flores de Molina. Present. Listen here. Thank you, Carlos. Diana Maribel Hueso Portillo. Present, teacher. Thank you, Diana. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Present, teacher. Thank you, Mr. Irving Otoniel Escamilla Guerra. Iván Alberto Castillo Alas. Jocelyn Karen Meléndez Rivas. José Alfredo Hueso López. Hmm. Julio César Aguillón Arevalo. Present teacher. Lady Joana Hernández Ventura. Present. Marjorie Angélica Ardón Granillo. Present teacher. Nilton Alexander Vázquez Galvez. Present. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Present teacher. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Arevalo. Santos Claudia Pineda. Present. Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present teacher. Walter Ernesto Pérez Galvez. Present teacher. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. Let's see. Thank you, Ruth. Thank you, Karen. So let's continue. I still got time. Uh, <laughs> hey, Rafael. Good evening. How are you? Hey, teacher. Good evening. How is it going, my friend? I'm fine. That's cool. Yeah. That's cool. How was the day? Hey. Uh, only working now. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, that's the same old story from everybody, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 More, more now, uh, probably uh, application. A core application, so 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 stress. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can imagine. Yeah, you know the problem is this that, I mean, we wouldn't be that troubled about uh, stuff like working, but the problem is that we got bad habits. El problema con el trabajo es que tenemos malos hábitos, like. We like to eat, you know, we like to get dressed, no gusta comer, ropa, and we need the salary. That's the problem. If it weren't for those little details, si no fuera por los detallitos, I wouldn't work. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, but that's the problem, it's right? Really... <laughs> How many kids do you have, Rafael? 
Excuse me? How many kids do you have? No, no, no. No, no kids. kids. Oh, no, that's kids. cool. Uh, so, uh, to, to dog. <laughs> you single? You are single? You are single. Es soltero? Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, uh, I'm married in, in 10 years. <laughs> 10 years ago, man. No kids. Wow. Oh, no, excuse me. Uh, 12 years. 12 years ago. Man. Yeah. In years. Uh, 10, uh, 2010. 2010. 2010. Wow. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah, yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, nice. And no kids? Cool. <laughs> no, kids are nice. Kids are nice. Believe me. But... Strategy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. My strategy was different. My strategy yeah, was like... Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Mine was like, oops. <laughs> you know, that happens. It was a very different strategy, but it works. It works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, in the uh... end, you know. No, the only difference is this. Uh, I'm 43. My son is 20. He's almost out of the university. And it's the yeah. only one. No. So More now on, on, on day is uh, pesado, no sé. Yeah, heavy. Yeah, it is. Okay, yeah. Yes. So uh, like in two years, I'm going to be like, oh, man, this is easy. But now, man, I'm like, oh my gosh, this is crazy. Sin preocupación. <laughs> yeah. But I need to wait like two, two more years. Me faltan como dos años más. Nah. <laughs> Time flies. Yes. Yeah, I I joke mm. with him like, uh, like uh, I'm just waiting for you to graduate so I can kick you out. Oh. Yeah, yo bromeo con él. Digo que espero que se gradúe para darle su patadita. Yeah. Uh, uh, bueno, depende. <ríe> Porque por, por ejemplo, yo todavía sigo, sigo estudiando por la universidad. Oh, really? Yeah, no, no, I mean, that's cool. Yeah. No, in my case, uh, I'm joking with him because, man, it's expensive. Wow. Starting now, no, it's yeah, expensive. Yeah. <ríe> And some careers are like even crazier. Y algunas carreras son like, Man, you don't stop spending. Like in his case, he's studying. Uh, what's your career? Engineer system. System. Oh my gosh. It's hard. Engineer system. Oh, really? Yes, it's hard. Uh, three, three year. Uh, Third year. Four, two, six. One, two, three, four, five. Six, 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 six cycle in the uh, University of Salvador. Yeah, uh, my son is in the seventh. No, let's see. One, two, three, six. Yeah, he's my son is in his seventh cycle, seventh semester. We say like this, seventh semester, oh. and so, so. yeah, that's the fourth year. He's studying. Um, It's gonna be a bachelor in physical therapy. Oh, <laughs> gonna be a physical therapist. Yeah, it's crazy. You know, tonight after I finish here, I'm gonna go help him with some homeworks. Man, that's crazy. Yeah. Good look. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, it's like uh, next month he's going to the hospital for practices. Oh my gosh. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But what can we do? Crazy. Yeah, what can we do? Hey, Rafael, nice talking to you. Thank you very much. Hey, thank you, teacher. Oh, thanks to you. So let's see, Walter. Hello, how are you? Hi, teacher. Hi, Hi. how's everything? Good, very nice. That's great, that's great. How was the yes. day? Uh, I am um, a good day. Um, today is a, in the routine. 
Y yeah. en, en el work. <laughs> yeah, routines, routines. Uh, tell me about it. But, yes. I mean. Yes. Sometimes, you know, the routine is something good. Uh, yes, so, so. <clears throat> Sometimes it's... the routine is good because the routine, I mean, you focus on the routine and everything and you like, you like just let the time pass. I mean, yes. particularly when there are many, when there are hard days, cuando los días son duros. And I mean, there's a lot of work. Sometimes the, the routine is the one that helps you fulfill all the activities. A veces la rutina es la que nos ayuda a completar las actividades. Yes. Because, you know, processes, you follow processes, you follow steps, you know that first this, then after that you do another thing, and after that you know another step, and when you realize, <laughs> okay, one activity, over. Next activity, you start yes. over. Yeah. Okay. I mean. Okay. But it's a little boring. Yeah. Every yeah. day, every course, day, every day. Of course, of <laughs> I understand yes. you. But you know, every job gets its ups and downs. Ups and downs. Every job yes. is like that. Sometimes I mean like uh some people like work outside in the field and uh, and it's cool because they go out and everything you say, but man, like <laughs> imagine uh you are out of the office, the the weather there's different situations you have to encounter mm, yes safety and if you are driving a car you know the problems with the car transportation it's i mean it's complex yes complex and yes, working yes. out working out of the office the other problem is that we spend more money <laughs> yes yeah, because yeah, you yeah. see something, you want to buy something, you want to eat, you want to drink. And whereas when you are in the in the office, I mean, you stay in the office, you fulfill the schedule, you are like uh, just lunch time, little break time, mm -hmm. and, and that's it. So yes. as I told you, pros and cons. Eh. Yes, it's a costumbre. Yeah, have it. Have it, yes. Well, yes. the good thing is that there's a job. But when I travel. Yes, yes. That's it's what really thing. matters. That's <laughs> really important. Yes, yes. It's the important the work every day. <laughs> yeah, of course. As I was telling the uh, Rafael, the problem is that we have the bad habits of eating and stuff like that. <laughs> Los malos son esas malas costumbres como comer y todo eso. Come. Yeah. Yes. But that's life. Hey, Walter, welcome. Okay. Thank you, teacher. So let's see Marjorie. Hello, Marjorie. How are you? Hello, teacher. How's everything? Good. Cool. Okay. How was the day for you? Mm, yeah, a lot of work. But fine. A lot of work. Come on. But a lot of work is good. Nah, okay, sometimes it's crazy, it, right? Time, uh, time pass. Yeah, time really? flies. Yeah, of course. Time <laughs> flies. El tiempo vuela. Time flies. <laughs> when you're very flies. busy. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Yes. Ya esta hora ya está pasando factura. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, that's a, just... that's a viejita, teacher. Whatever. <laughs> the problem is not the how old are you. The problem is how beat up we are. Mira, mi caso no es los años, es lo beat up. <laughs> yeah, because, I mean, it's just yeah. a matter of, of sometimes, sometimes, of course, it's heavy. Nowadays, I mean, it's heavy and it's complex. You worry about a lot of stuff. Tenemos tantas preocupaciones, more stress. 
and you know many obligations but it takes time but whatever mm -hmm. comes you will overcome it so another day on the trenches and remember another day another dollar <laughs> yes and that's that's motivation mm -hmm. another day another dollar la comida para los chicos yeah. <laughs> es lo que nos motiva <laughs> sacar adelante a los chicos sí. yeah of course I mean because they eat as crazy porque si comen man I don't know yeah the kids eat a lot <laughs> but what can we do que se le va a hacer Right? Exactly. Exactly, exactly. Well, Marjorie, welcome. Nice having you here. Thanks, teacher. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. And okay, who else? Carlos Miguel, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. Hello, how um, are you? I'm tired. I'm very tired. Oh, really? A hard day at work? Yes, I finish. I finished trip. Uh, I trip in on San Salvador today. Oh really? Yes. So I travel you... three hours. Three hours. Uh, oh. from San Miguel to to San Salvador. Three hours from San Miguel to San Salvador. Uh, yeah, that's special. That's special. I understand you. You know, I had to go, like, today I was working, and at noon they told me that something happened and I needed to go. I went to, I mean, I work, I live in San Martin, but I work in a, in a little town, a little bit far. So at noon I came home. I had to call for a, for transportation. I came home. I took out the car and I went to Comalapa. Well, a little bit after Comalapa and just round. I mean, I just I just stopped. I dropped somebody, pick up somebody, and then came back home. I was driving from one to four thirty. Man, that's tiring. But I mean, it's part of the part of the game, right, Carlo? Carlo, oh, there you go. Hello. Yeah, I mean, some days are like that, and it's as I was telling you, it's part of the game, right? We need to do it. We have to do it. What can we do? ¿Qué le vamos a hacer? Um, Carlos, nice having you here. Thank you. No, thanks to you. Thanks to you, my friend. I still got time? Yeah, still got time. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Ana Verónica. Hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? Uh, I'm fine, and you? Ah, uh, you know, here it's same old story as usual. That's right. I mean, same story, same story. What can I tell you? I mean, working and running some errands, same stuff. But what about you? Tell me, how's everything? Same for me at work. 
Same old story. How do you know? Definitely. Listen, um, um, the, the class English. The English class. The English class. Wow, that's nice. What was there for dinner? Uh, tomato, cream, uh, tortillas. Uh, and chicken. <laughs> Tortilla. Tortilla. Ah. Yeah, yeah, because that sound doesn't exist in English. El sonido oh. de la LG no existe. In English, okay. oh, you say tortilla. Tortilla. Yeah. Interesting. Tomato. Sí, tomato. Tomato. <laughs> you know, I, I have seen, I have seen a... I'm sorry to say it like this. I have seen some people eating like that, but it's all people. Like, uh, like I know a guy, he's like 60. Sometimes he gets a tomato, salt, a piece of cheese, and a tortilla, and he's happy. Mm. For me, it's a big no-no. I need something fried. Yo necesito algo frito. Ah, no. Yeah. I, need, I need fat. If not, it doesn't work. If not, it's like no eating for me. Si no es como que no haya comido. I lot of and ate this fast most junk. Comí mucha chatarra estos meses atrás. <laughs> Man. Uh, I, eat it, I eat it whenever I can. Yo me lo trago siempre que puedo. Ah, no. I love young food. Oh, no. Thanks. Yeah. No healthy. No healthy. <laughs> Look, they test me for uh, fat. Me han revisado la, 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 what do you call? Well, everything. Triglycerides mm -hmm. and the, 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 the sugar and fat and no problem. So, I'm allowed to eat everything. Tengo permiso de comerme todo. So, no problem. No, así no. <laughs> yeah, I have not a problem. They they even tested me for the, for the, the, the level. So, the tolerance of sugar and it was perfect. So, man, no problem for me. I eat everything. My only problem is my gastritis. Mi único problema es la gastritis. But with a couple of pills, solved. Par de pastillas, resuelto. It's like Ay. pizza. Don't you like pizza, Veronica? Eh, don't like. Eh. Don't like no. Oh, no, I'm no. so sorry for you, poor little thing. <laughs> Ay, qué pena. Como lo <laughs> I'm so sorry. Tú hago gastritis también. Tengo gastritis y eso me altera. Mucho condimento. Sweetie, I got gastritis since I, since I was seven. Yo la tengo de los siete años. So, I ah. no, no, no. And I eat, no. I can eat the eight slices. Yo me como las ocho porciones. Dios. Look, my goodness. if I eat, if, you know, my, my perfect dinner or lunch is a uh, uh, regular, a big, uh, a regular pizza, una de ocho porciones. An order of garlic bread, an order de pan con ajo, uh -huh. half a liter of beer, medio beer. litro de cerveza, and I'm perfect. <laughs> I mean, it gets like right here. Por aquí me quedan. Perfect. Oh, man, that's life. Rafael is exciting, me. Yeah, <laughs> he knows what's that. Él sabe lo que es eso. He knows what's that. Yeah, you can tell and that smile. He says like, oh yeah, that's good. <laughs> good no. day. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Julio is the same. Julio is like, yeah, we are there. We are there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, in my house, one pizza is not enough. I mean, oh. 
I feel punished if they just buy one. Yo me siento castigado si solo compran una. Yeah, because, oh man, we love pizza. And what about hamburgers? Don't you like hamburgers? I like hamburger in a specific place. Oh, really? Which ones? Um, McDonald's. Okay. Uh, Burger King, not Wendy's. <laughs> you don't like Wendy's? No, not Wendy's. I like Wendy's. I like Wendy's no. and Burger King. No. McDonald's, I don't usually visit. They are too small. ¿Cómo se diría empachado en inglés? O sea... Fed up, oh. fed up. ¿Cómo? Fed up, fed up. Ah, pues, estoy... Fed, is fed up, up, eh, Wendy's. Oh, really? No. Uh -huh. no, you know, that's uh, from chains. Um, those are the two options. De cadenas, esas son mis opciones. But okay. uh, different place. Uh, I like... Uh, what's the name of this place? Uh, Charlie Boys. Charlie Boy's hamburgers are good. Yeah, they are big and fat. Son grandes y mantecositos. Man, that's delicious. And you see, Rafael knows what I'm talking about. You like, you like uh, greasy food. Greasy, greasy. Greasy food, uh-huh. You like greasy food. Yeah, sure. It's bad for my body. Of course I like it. Uh, no, 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 no. I have come to realize that everything that they say is good for your body tastes bad. Todo lo que me dicen que es bueno para el cuerpo sabe mal, so. Es cierto, usted es lo contrario. It's yeah. uh, positive. <laughs> yeah, so I mean, I go for that. Man, they, they sell a big one with a rib. Hay una que la venden con, con un pedazo de costilla. Man, that thing is, oh, you get nasty. <laughs> Uh, you know Pizza. something I don't usually eat with my hands. I cannot eat with my hands. Yo no sé comer con las manos. But when uh -huh. it comes to that, I get like. <sighs> yeah, I get... Alita, alitas, I like. Uh, you I know. know yeah, but the problem is that, I mean, I need to eat like 12, uh -huh. 15. Hay que cruzarse unas 15. So you can get like. Like so so. Okay. <laughs> okay. But yeah, no, you know, you know. No, it's just that. Uh, but I mean, I don't eat like that every day. No, como así todos los días. They don't let me at home. No me dejan. If okay. it were for me, oh man, I like hot dogs. I love hamburgers. I love, totally love pizza. And, and that's it. Yeah, I like junk food. As I told you, tastes good. Okay. Me. Hey, Ana Veronica, nice talking to you. Welcome. My pleasure. Okay, guys. Later on, we're going to talk again about food. Later on. Right now, we're going to jump into another topic. Because, uh, as I told you, yesterday we were working with... Um, with something very interesting. And today we are going to uh, use some of the information we have seen in the previous classes in order, give me one second. Sorry, guys. I don't know what's going on. Oh, my gosh. So, today we are going to talk about directions and instructions. Do you remember? That's the name of the unit. Okay. And first, we're going to see a small, small conversation. And we are going to keep on talking about locations in a workplace. And we are going to add a little bit. Vamos a agregar un poquito más. Okay. So we're going to use instructions. Uh, the other day you were helping me, giving me instructions about how to prepare something, right? But now you are going to give me instructions about getting to a place, but don't worry. We got time, we got time. So 
The conversation goes like this. Remember, now, I don't want you to open your manual. No necesito que abran el manual. Just to listen to me, okay? As the other day, como el otro día. So, the conversation goes like this. Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I am providing some safety instructions today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk between the yellow lines. And don't forget to wear the earplugs all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. I repeat. Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I'm providing some safety instructions today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk between the yellow lines. And don't forget to wear the earplugs all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. Now, guys, remember, just listen and repeat after me, okay? No checking in the manual, no checking in the manual. Just listen and repeat. Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Safety engineer. New floor safety engineer. Introduce the new floor safety engineer. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. It's a pleasure to introduce the new safety engineer. Hey, okay. hello everybody. I am Mary. And I am providing some safety instructions today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk between the yellow lines. And don't forget to wear the earplugs. all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. Perfect, guys. I will repeat one more time. So for the recording that I always send you. Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I'm providing some safety instructions today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk between the yellow lines. And don't forget to wear the earplugs all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. Okay, guys, I'm going to send you the, the capture, the screenshot of the conversation to the group. Right now, today, I'm not going to even show it to you here. As I told you, the, the dynamic of the exercises sometimes is going to change. And you will see another change change that we are going to introduce today. 
but uh, I'm sure you will like the, the way we will perform the activity. Let's see. Okay, it's perfect. There you go. You have it in the group. Uh, you have the audio, you need to check it out. I'm gonna send you to the breakout rooms. And there's a little twist also. You're not gonna be working in pairs. You're gonna be working in groups of three members. Just some of you are gonna work in pairs. Let me check. Hmm. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, groups are open, jump in. Ivan, Ivan Alberto, hello. Hello, teacher. Good night. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good, good evening. Como me está saludando es good evening. Okay, I will send you to a group. Lo envío a un grupo ahorita, okay? Okay. Let me go check the groups, let's see. Are the air, air plugs all the time. Air plugs. It's important. Come on. Air plugs. Air plugs. <clears throat> air plugs all the time. It is important not to get Close to red areas. 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 Okay. Areas. Okay. Okay. I say Walter. Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. Everybody. I am Mary, and I am provi providing some safety instructions today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. We are helmet all the time. Wall between the yellow lines. And don't forget to wear the air plug.
60 seconds, 60 seconds. Okay, let's see. Walter Ernesto and Claudia Pineda. Walter, you start. Okay, I am Walter. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure, pleasure to introduce the new floor safety and engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary and I am providing some safer instruction today. Tell us about the Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk between the yellow line and don't forget to wear the earplug all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. Okay, perfect now. Claudia and Walter. Claudia, you start. Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safer engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I am providing some safety safety into introduction today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk between the yellow lines and don't forget to wear the earplugs all the time. It is important not, not to get close to red areas. Perfect, thank you. Ana Veronica and Lady. Ana Veronica, you start. Hey, good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I am providing some safety introductions today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk be between the yellow lines, and don't forget to wear the Airplugs all the time. It's important not to get close to red areas. Yeah. Okay. okay, switch. Switch. Okay. Uh, good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to, to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. 
I am Mary and I am providing some software introductions today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. We're help me all the time. Walk between the yellow lines and don't forget to wear, to wear the earplugs all the time. It is important not to get close to the red areas. Okay, thank you very much. Now, 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 now. Okay, who was the first couple? ¿Quiénes fueron la primera pareja? Let's see. Uh, Rafael and Veronica Elizabeth. Yes, please, Rafael. Okay. Good morning, everybody. Eh, perdón. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to enter the new floor. Safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I'm Mary, and I am providing some safety intrusion today. Just... Tell us about that, Mrs. Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk between the yellow lines, and don't forget to wear the earplugs all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. Switch, please. Okay. Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I provide providing some safety intrusion today. So us about that, uh, Miss Mary. Tell us. Tell us. Tell us about that, uh, Miss Mary. Tell us. Okay. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk be wearing the yellow lines. And don't forget to wear the earplugs all the time. It's important not to get close to red areas. Okay, perfect. Tell us, tell us, tell us. Now, uh, 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 Nilton and Marjorie. Nilton, you will start. Okay. I am Walter, brother. Yes, please. Okay. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineers. Hello, everybody. I'm Mary, and I am, and I'm providing some safety instructions today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Wall between the yellow line, uh, and don't forget to wear the air pose all the time. It is important not to get us. Oh. Not to get close to red areas. Areas. Okay, switch please. Okay. Good morning, every, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I am provide some safety introduction today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time while between the yellow lines. And don't forget to wear the earplugs all the time. It is important not to get close to areas. Areas, areas. 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 Okay, thank you. Perfect. 
Julio Aguichón and Jose Alfredo. Jose Alfredo, you ready? Okay, teacher. Okay, Jose Alfredo, you start. Estamos con todo acá. Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new first safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I'm Murray. I am providing some safety instruction today. Tell us about that, Miss Murray. We are helped all the time. Walk between the yellow line and don't forget to wear the air plug all the time. It's important not to get close to red areas. Okay, switch, please. Good morning, everyone. Okay. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary. I am Mary, and I am provide some software introduction today. Tell us about. Wear, wear a helmet all the time. What between the yellow lines? And don't forget to wear to L plus all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Now, Thank you, teacher. no thanks to you guys. Diana Maribel and Ana Marlene. Diana. Okay. Hello. Good morning, everyone. It is a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I am providing some safety. Safety, ¿cómo se pronuncia de echar esa palabra? Safety. Safety instruction today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk between the yellow lines. And don't forget to wear the earplugs all the time. It is important not to get too close to red areas. Red areas. Red areas. Switch, please. Hey, good morning, everyone. It is a pleasure to introduce a new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I am providing, providing some safety providing, providing, today. Providing. Providing. Providing some safety introductions today. Tell us about that, Mrs. Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Well, between the yellow lines and don't forget to wear the airplanes all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Eric Josué and Carlos Miguel. Eric, you start. Hello. Okay. Good morning, everyone. Uh, it is a pleasure to introduce the new flower safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I am providing some safety instruction today. Tell us about that, Mrs. Mary. Where I helmet all the time, while between the yellow lines. And don't forget to wear the earplugs all the time. 
it is important not to get close to red areas. Red areas. Okay. Did you switch already? You're right. Good morning, everyone. It's a pressure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I am uh, providing some safety introduction today. Tell us about uh, that, Miss Mary. Where are the hard me uh, all the time? While between the yellow lane, and don't forget to wear the air plus all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. Okay, guys, thank you. Ivan Alberto. Hello, Ivan, you ready? Yes. Okay. Good morning, everyone. It's a pleasure to introduce the new floor safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary, and I am providing some safety instruction today. Providing. Provide. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet out all the time. Wear between the yellow line. And don't forget to wear the air pro, air pro all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. Okay, thank you. Now you start, Ivan. Good morning, everyone. E everyone, it's a pleasure to introduce the new flow safety engineer. Hello, everybody. I am Mary and I am providing some safety instructions today. Tell us about that, Miss Mary. Wear a helmet all the time. Walk between the yellow lines. And don't forget to wear the earplugs all the time. It is important not to get close to red areas. Perfect. Thank you, guys. Okay, now, it is very important that we check this. Let me show you. Well, I need to get the attendance, I'm sorry. Okay, Ana Marlene Andrade de Osorio. Present, teacher. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. Carlos Miguel Umaña Lobo. Present, teacher. Thank you, Clelia Estela Flores de Molina. Diana Maribel Hueso Portillo. Present teacher. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Present teacher. Irving Otoniel Escamilla Guerra. Iván Alberto Castillo Alas. Present teacher. Jocelyn Karen Meléndez Rivas. Thank you, Jocelyn. Iván Alberto Castillo Alas. I'm sorry. José Alfredo Hueso okay. López. Present teacher. Julio César Aguillón Arevalo. Present teacher. Lady Joana Hernández Ventura. Present teacher. Marjorie Angélica Ardón Granillo. Present. Nilton Alexander Vázquez Galvez. Present. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Present teacher. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Arevalo. Thank you, Ruth. Santos Claudia Pineda. Present. Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present teacher. And Walter Ernesto Perez Galvez. Present teacher. Okay, guys, let me share with you. Okay, look. 
Look at here. We got, you're at the parking and you have these questions. Where are the restroom? Where is quality control? Where is the manager office? Where is the exit? And you got here, the map. If you see, you got every place like production area, reception area, planning area, manager office, and you go parking lot. So you are here. And in order to get to the production area, okay, when we are giving instructions, we use part of this vocabulary. Look, go straight, turn left, turn right, walk 10 meters, 10 meters, walk through the production area. Walk through means atravesar. Okay, so turn left, girar a la izquierda, turn right, girar a la derecha. Now, those are common instructions. We are, we are going to do these exercises, uh, but this exercise number five and exercise number six is going to be a homework, okay? This is a homework, number five and number six. Right now, what we are going to do, it's something a little bit different. We are going to add a little twist to the activity. Okay, I'll give you a situation. The problem is that I am from another country, okay? I am driving. Listen, I am driving. I am driving a car. I am at Salvador del Mundo. Okay, listen up. I am at Salvador del Mundo and I have a problem. I need instructions. Necesito instrucciones. How to get to a place. Como llegar a un lugar. So, taking into an account that I am right there, a group number one, that is uh, Ana Veronica, Claudia Pineda, Jose Alfredo, Marjorie, and Ruth. You are going to explain to me how do I get to University of El Salvador. Okay. I am at Salvador del Mundo. How do I get to Universidad del Salvador? I need the instructions. Group number two. Group number two, okay, look, I am a uh, Salvador del Mundo, and I need to get to, let's see, uh, 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 uh. Pepade, that's by Merdiot, right? Group number three. I am, again, same spot. I am at Salvador del Mundo, and I need to get to uh, Parque Infantil. And group number four, that is uh, Ana Marlene, Diana, Eric, and Ivan, same spot, right? Salvador del Mundo. But in this case, I have the problem that I need to get to Hospital Militar. That's by uh, 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 next to Sobre la Bernal, right? Not, not going down. No Sobre la Roosevelt. I'm talking about the hospital, the new one. Okay? So, Group number one is, let's see, group number one is Ana Verónica, Claudia, Jose Alfredo, Marjorie, Ruth. You got U.S. Pepade is Julio Aguillón, Lady, Rafael, and Verónica. Parque Infantil, Carlos, Jocelyn, Milton, and Walter. And Hospital Militar, Ana Marlene, Diana, Eric, and Ivan. Okay, guys, you will have eight minutes. Now, here you can use the maps if you need it. Si necesitan, usan el mapa. Remember, I am by car. Voy en automóvil. I am driving. So you just need to give me the instructions. Drive like for 10 blocks, drive for one kilometer or approximately two kilometers. Instructions like that. Turn right, turn left. Those are very important. 
okay? And when you arrive to the destination, you say, and you are there, okay? Questions, preguntas? No, okay, let's do the activity, okay, guys, okay. Please don't get me loose, no me van a perder. Okay. You need to check the map, right? Okay, ahorita les comparto. Ya pueden ver. Oh, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Eh... Okay, vamos a ver. Quiero ver, centrar esto. But is eh, walk. Conduciendo a oh, teacher o caminando. Driving, driving. Ok. Ah, hmm. uh -huh. oh, lo perdí. Un okay. Bueno, if you want to place me on the area, it's easy. Si quiere ubicarme solo en la área, es fácil. <laughs> Because, I mean, if I am at Salvador del Mundo, I need to take a constitution until I get to Juan Pablo II, then turn, turn right on Juan Pablo II and all the way down, right? Okay. Take. Eh, que no quiero ver dónde estaba para escribir. Ah, aquí está. Quiero ver. Quiero ver la 49, Avenida Francisco, no. 53, no. Esta es la 49. Esta es la 49. Ese es el paso de nivel. Este es el paso de nivel. Ajá. Cuando llega, baja eh, aquí por esta 47 Avenida, uh -huh. cruza mano derecha, luego nuevamente a la derecha y se incorpora a la 49 Avenida Sur. Luego de aquí, entonces, ¿cómo sería? Go extra en la media Roosevelt, dobla la, ¿qué sería? A la, a la derecha. Ajá, solo que tendríamos que mencionar, ah, va, en 47 Avenida Sur. Go straight, sería. Down, go straight down on Roosevelt Avenue. Uh -huh. Turn right on 47 South Avenue. Turn right on Or, uh, West Street and turn right on 49 South Avenue. I just make rights, right? Solo tomo a la derecha. Sí. No, porque luego acá ya pasamos todo a la 49. Oh. Then you go, go straight on 49th Avenue until 
y de ahí llegamos, Ale. pasamos a un metro centro, Ale. las tres torres. Un boulevard de los héroes sería. Ajá, cabal. O sea, nos incorporamos, después de la, de la 47 nos incorporamos al boulevard de los... Solo que ahí donde nos incorporamos es la 49 todavía. Y todavía yeah. no se llama, creo, Boulevard changed, de los Héroes. It just changes the name along the way. Solo cambia el nombre en el camino. Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> you need to explain me that because I don't know San Salvador, ¿ok? No vamos a ir a perder. Yeah, no I vamos a ir a perder. I'm worried. I'm worried. <laughs> ya me preocupé. <laughs> I should have called an Uber. <laughs> calle la 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 Ahí aquí está, está la panamericana Ajá, ve pues, si venimos sobre la Enrique Carajo es recto hasta cruzar nada más a on the right. Eh, ah, bueno, sí, llegamos siempre al mismo redondel, vean. Sí, al mismo redondel llegamos. Ah, pues sí, cualquiera. La que se desee. Yo siento que la paseo, el paseo solo hacemos dos cruces. Ah, pues vámonos por ese. Y hacemos Entonces, una paradita por el paradito de la Sí. Yeah, that's easy. Yo just, just go all the way up on Paseo General Escalón. Go all the way up. Go all the way up. Go all the way up. Ay, mira, pisé. Sí, porque lo caminamos todo. Ahí pues estamos en esta parte que está ya rápido, que me dicen. Luego, a mano que es que otra cosa sería Avenida Bernal, luego por esta calle recta y llegamos al hospital Militar Central. Teacher, we are lost, teacher. I'm sorry. Es que ninguno de nosotros conoce y con el Google Maps tira como que solo ubicación. Ah, con el Google Maps le tiene que poner usted de dónde parte y en la de abajo ponerle a dónde llega. Porque habría que colocarle el nombre de las calles por donde va a pasar ¿verdad? y todo eso. Yep. Yeah, but it's easy. En el caso de ustedes está fácil. I need to get to. Necesito ver a. Okay, if I am at Salvador del Mundo, I take a... a Constitución Boulevard until a... Calle San Antonio Abad. I turn right on Calle San Antonio Abad. Go down for one, two, two blocks or three blocks, if I'm not mistaken. And then turn right on Avenida Bernal. And after one, two, and after two blocks, I am there. Está mm. facilita. Es que como no conocemos, esa es la dificultad. Llego <laughs> llorente y los compañeros no se... <laughs> No. Damos perdido. Ok, ok, let's see, let's see. Vamos a ver cómo nos ayudamos acá. Ok. 
por el Boulevard Constitución. Yep. Me parece tomar mano y derecha, pero no me da el nombre de la calle. No, este... Okay, guys, let's see. Can you check my screen? Hello, can ver mi pantalla? Yes. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, let's see. We are right here rotonda divino salvador del mundo right <laughs> okay we take boulevard constitución you see we take boulevard constitución all the way here we pass by los isimiles monumento a la constitución this is called la chulona right there you take a right ahí Cruza la derecha on calle San Antonio Abad. Ok. You go by one. And you can say, puede decir, cruce a la derecha. Y en el semáforo, turn left, cruza a la izquierda on Avenida Bernal. And here is Hospital Militar Central. Y two blocks after turning right is Hospital Militar. In your case, it's easy. It's just one right and one left. En el caso de ustedes es fácil. Es solamente uno cruce a la derecha y uno a la izquierda. Okay. Did you see it now? ¿Lo ven ahora? Yes. Yeah. It's right here. So, remember... Salvador del Mundo, you see? Vuelvo a la Constitución. Until we get to Monumento a la Constitución. Turn right on the roundabout. Se toma la primera salida a la derecha en el redondel. But you can say, take the first exit on the roundabout. Se toma la primera salida en el redondel. Continue on Calle San Antonio Abad. Then turn left on Avenida Bernal. And in two blocks, you are there. Got it? Se ubicaron? Yes. So you see, it's easy. No está tan complicado. Remember, you don't need to be that specific. With general instructions, I can make it. I just need to go on Boulevard Constitución, take the first exit on the roundabout, la primera salida en el rondel. Continue on Calle San Antonio Abad uh, for two blocks, then turn left on Avenida Bernal, two blocks, and I am there. Very simple. 
Yo sí, sí, sí. El de ustedes está fácil. Ok, guys. Did I get there or I didn't? ¿Llegué o no llegué? Eh, you're, quizás. You're lost. You lost. I'm lost. Why? Uh, Yours is easy. Es que miren, el de usted, you know San Salvador, right? Yes, yes. Okay, it's very simple. Eh, if I am in Salvador del Mundo, you tell me. Okay. Go on Boulevard Constitución, Constitución Boulevard, okay. until you get to Alameda Juan Pablo II. Turn okay. right. Turn right. On Alameda Juan Pablo II. And go all the way down. Y hay que irse todo hasta abajo. Hasta que uno llega a... Ah, veamos qué calle es esa. Mm. Mm. Yo sí. Eh, 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 eh. Oye. La tercera. La tercera yeah. avenida norte. Yeah. And parque infantil is in front. Y el parque infantil me queda al frente. Don't make it complex. Acuérdense, no hay que hacerlo complicado. No me quieren perder. Ustedes me van a dar las instrucciones lo más simple. <laughs> ok, teacher. Yeah. Uh, in this case, for the instruction, use until uh, for for place or to. Until. 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 Until get the get there. Yeah. Podría, podríamos utilizar until arrive. Yeah, oh. of course, of course. Sounds okay. even better. Suena aún mejor. Okay. Siete street, quiero ver en, y allí maneja como a los cuantos metros, unos diez metros. Eh, lo que después de la 47 es lo que dure, lo que tiene esa cuadra y es que llega a la cuarta calle, cuarta calle, creo que se llama esa. Ya le voy a mostrar. Then you say one block. Entonces, una cuadra. Ajá. Es un, una calle cabal. Eh, que es esta parte, ¿verdad? Usted aquí viene. No sé si logra uh -huh. ver el, el mapa. Sí, sí. Ajá. Ok. Usted viene acá. Uh -huh. Y luego se incorpora aquí a la 47. Ajá. Uh -huh. Y luego se, a la cuarta calle poniente. Caballo que Ajá. es la cuadra nada más. Ajá. Y pues, luego cruza sí, nuevamente sí, sí. A, la, a la izquierda. Cuarta. A la cuarta. Uh -huh. eh, eh, en turno sería. Si vengo manejando para acá, doblo a la, a la derecha. Turn, turn right. Turn Do, right. Turn right. Turn right. Uh -huh. right. uh -huh. Uh -huh. Y luego, ¿qué sería que se incorpora la 49? De aquí sale de un solo lado. Guys, if I end up in Santa Ana, I'll be mad. Si termino en Santa Ana, me va a dar algo. Go straight, Y vamos a teacher, ponga el ways. Yeah, no, ah, pues no, que lo ponga ya mejor. <laughs> que lo ponga ya. I'm, I'm getting worried, guys. I'm getting worried. Ya me preocupé. Ok, you can. Uh, 
el de ustedes es... Uh... La universidad. La US. Ay, sí, sí, sí. Es que se han complicado la vida. ¿Y por dónde ah. se quiere ir usted, dice? Make it easy. I am salvador del mundo. Send me uh -huh. by constitución all the way to calle San Antonio Abad. Mm, In the roundabout, uh -huh. the first exit to the right, and then all the way down on calle San Antonio Abad. Camino por constitución. Todo el camino hasta el monumento a la constitución, la chelona. Ahí tomo la calle San Antonio Abad. Toda para abajo hasta que llego a la universidad. Siento que da más vueltas ahí arriba. Lo único que el tráfico es más, más, más duro aquí en la 49. Eso no lo vamos a negar. Es que es una sola recta. Es una sola recta la que hago. Voy por constitución. Tomo. Es cierto. Yeah, that's easier. Es mucho más fácil. I mean, in that way, ladies, I just need to take one turn. Solo un cruce. One turn. Mm -hmm. Solo hago un cruce y lo único que tienen que tener cuidado es decirme que en el redondel del Toro Gos tomo la segunda salida. Como voy bajando, la primera es la que me va a tirar para, para los héroes. Entonces, no, tomo la segunda salida que es recto, es continua recto, ¿verdad? Sobre ah, el teacher se quiere ir aquí arriba, mire. Y aquí va. Make it smaller. Hágalo más chiquito. Ok. El teacher se quiere ir. Este es el paseo por aquí. Por aquí. This, remember, you are giving the instruction to somebody who's not from here. Usted le está dando las instrucciones a alguien que no es de acá. You need to make it simple. Mm. Va. Eh, entonces acá Esa exacto acá. arriba y si dice ah. para arriba va a llegar al bull al, al, al cómo se llama al, al, al roundabout al redondel al, re, al redondel cabal y ahí va para el son dos redondeles yep. el, el primero de el, de la, el de constitución y este el que está ahí arriba el de abajo que es el el, el Mm. Ah, cabal es el toro, toro gos. Mm -hmm. Exacto. Que donde está el monumento de la, de la constitución, que es la chulona. Yeah, exacto. Aquí, right aquí. Tomo la primera y ahí, a la derecha. De ahí toda la San Antonio Abad hasta ahí llegar a la U. Ya. Yeah. Taquería el rincón. Yeah, esa taquería es buenísima. Mm. <risa> Guys, I have díganle que, dinner. Díganle que pase por ahí. Díganle que pase por ahí. Antes de que llegue la U. Que pase llevando unos sacos. El, este es el redondel que usted dice, ¿verdad? Yep. El toro vos. En lugar de tomar tiene la que bajar. Industrial, sigo sobre calle San Antonio Abad. Uh -huh. Ahí di. Uh. Para abajo, para abajo, para abajo. Ahí está la U ya. Ya llegó la U. Aquí está la universidad. Uh -huh. Aquí está. Bueno, que aquí depende de dónde quiere entrar. <risa> Pero no nos diga, no, no nos diga qué facultad quiere ir. Oh, <risa> medicine. Me, medicine, ok. Aquí esa sí se va, tendría que irse por acá. Tendría que irse y por acá. Y compramos unos chori y después nos vamos para medicine. Yeah. Son buenísimos esos también. Short. Mm. Vaya, para no hacerla complicada, entremos a odontología. Exacto. Ajá, sí que por ahí le había, íbamos a decirle que entrara también. <ríe> okay, guys, sixty seconds. 60 seconds, hurry up, wrap it up.
Okay, let's see. Everybody's coming. Everybody's coming. Oh, guys, guys, guys. Let's see. Let's just wait for everybody to come back. Vamos a esperar que todos vuelvan. Let's see in a few seconds and everybody's back right about now. Okay, guys, tell me, tell me, tell me. Let's see, shall I worry? Debo preocuparme. Some of your instructions, I don't know where I will end up. No sé dónde voy a acabar. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Group number one, that's US, going to US. Tell me, guys. Who's going to talk to me? ¿Quién me va a dar las instrucciones? Marjorie. <laughs> okay. Oh, no, no. <laughs> you are not. Yeah, no. <laughs> Tell me, Marjorie. You're the assign. No, porque ya nos dijo que lo vamos a perder. <laughs> okay, come on. Tell me, tell me. Give me the instructions. Let's see. Who's in the group? Vamos, ¿quiénes van en este grupo? That's, mm, yeah, Ana Verónica. Claudia, Claudia, you tell me. Oops, Claudia is having problems with her device. Okay, let's do something, guys. Vamos a hacer algo. I need you to please... I need you to please uh, send me the instructions written. I'm taking a... a, a picture of how the groups are established. Me llevo una fotografía de cómo están armados los grupos. I need you to one of member of per group send me the instructions que me envíe las instrucciones. And tomorrow we will have the presentation, okay? Y mañana me lo presentan. So that's that will give you time to like wrap it up. I need the written instructions. That's important because I need to focus on the way we give instructions. Porque me voy a enfocar en cómo damos instrucciones. Okay? But as we still have time, pero como todavía tenemos tiempo, first off, tell me, how do you like that activity? ¿Qué les parece esa actividad? Excellent. 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 Because on time we are in the other country, we need the instruction okay. to, to get a places. Yeah, yeah, of course. It's it's complex. And I mean, it's very interesting that we understand the way they explain to us. Like, yes, I like... have an experience teacher. A uh, one time, uh, once uh, I, I visited San Francisco, California, and got it lost. Yeah, how to ask the question. Yeah, and I mean, there are some expressions like go straight, siga recto. Yeah. Uh, when you are in a roundabout, you say take the first, the second, the third exit, cuando estamos en un redondel, decimos tome la primera, la segunda, la tercera salida, mm -hmm. right? And, you know, turn right, turn left, and there you are. And when we arrive, you can say, and there you are, or you are there. Same expression, okay? It's very important for us to remember, giving instructions is done using just uh, the imperatives, okay? You don't need to use you. You just go straight with the verb. Nos vamos mal con el verbo. That's why. Take, turn, drive, okay? Go straight ahead. 
continúe recto. I mean, those, those instructions always start with just the verb. Comienzan siempre con el verbo. You don't need a subject there because it is understood that the subject is always you. Se sobreentiende que el sujeto es siempre you. Okay? Do you have any question about that? ¿Hay alguna pregunta al respecto? No? Okay. Well, no. guys, let's see. Uh, for tonight goes... Oh, Marjorie, I'm sorry. Can you stay tonight after the class a few minutes? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Now, let me get the final attendance, guys. Wow. This activity took a lot of time. Ana Marlene Andrade de Osorio. Present teacher. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. Carlos Miguel Umaña Lobo. Lely Estela Flores de Molina. Thank you, Carlos. Diana Maribel Hueso Portillo. Eric Josué Reyes Molina, Irving Otoniel Escamilla Guerra, Iván Alberto Castillo Alas, Jocelyn, thank you, thank you, Jocelyn Karen Meléndez Rivas, José Alfredo Hueso López, present. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, 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 Julio Cesar Aguillón Arevalo. Present. Lady Joana Hernández Ventura. Present teacher. Marjorie Angélica Ardón Granillo. Present. Nilton Alexander Vázquez Galvez. Present. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Present teacher. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Arevalo. Santos Claudia Pineda. Present. Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present teacher. And Walter Ernesto Perez Galvez. Present teacher. Hey guys, thank you very much. I really, really appreciate it. See you tomorrow. Try to be on time, please. Have a good night. Good night, See teacher. You. See you. Have a good night to you, teacher. Thank you. you. Yeah, sure. Bye. See you tomorrow. See you. Okay, Marjorie, Marjorie. Oh, Marjorie's got homework, right? She siempre tiene tareas. Okay. Hello, Marjorie. Uh, these 10 minutes, we are going to make it. Vamos a tratar de cortarlo. Yo sé que usted pasa muy ocupadita después de la clase. Uh, tell me, is there any topic, any specific topic that you feel you need to reinforce or perhaps one of the topics taught in the class ¿Hay algún tema que le gustaría reforzar o quizás alguno de los vistos en clase that you feel like mm, it's not that clear que quizás sienta que no está del todo claro your microphone I'm sorry you don't want to talk to me too much. come on Marjorie is the um, hasta el momento siento que no Oh. De los que vi antes, eh, los que se si me cuesta un poquito es la pronunciación de los pasados. Oh. Pero de los, ajá. Yeah, that's a matter <ríe> of practice. Esa sí es una cuestión de práctica. Ajá, sí. Pero estamos hablando Ahorita de los pasados es... con ED o de los. O de los... Sí. No, con, con ED, ajá, que, que tienen diferente pronunciación. de eh, Esa sí me cuesta un poquito. Quiero ver. Ahorita he sentido raro porque sí, digamos que con usted hemos salido un poquito quizás de la zona de confort. No, yo sé, yo sé. I'm sorry. Sí, pero, pero sí, no, yo, yo sé también de que tenemos que, la verdad que es parte de, pues, si no, yeah, no the, vamos a aprender. Actually, the idea is, eh, la idea es que ustedes puedan Precisamente eso, salir de no quedarnos encasillados solamente en un tipo de vocabulario, porque realmente, eh, a pesar de que this is English for work, desde luego, mi enfoque siempre principal es 
el inglés para el trabajo. But actually, you also need the other vocabulary. Usted también necesita el otro vocabulario. No, exacto. Exacto, exacto. Eso sí. Y, lo, y lo, aquello que estábamos acostumbrados, que como que el inglés que hemos recibido, bueno, en mi caso, casi que toda la vida, es como un tipo reading comprehension, nada más, ¿verdad? Como mm. agarrar las cosas básicas de lo que estoy más que todo leyendo y pues <ríe> arreglármelas con eso, ¿verdad? Ajá, pero yo, sí, yo sé que tenemos que, que entrar más de lleno también con la pronunciación y pues aumentar nuestro vocabulario, ¿verdad? Pero sí me está costando un poquito. <ríe> no se lo voy a negar. No, no, es normal, Ajá. es normal. Mire, lo que pasa es esto. También debe tomar en cuenta el nivel en el que están. Eh, ya estamos llegando casi a los intermedios. Entonces, uh -huh. ya acá se le comienza a exigir un poquito más. La otra es esta. Yo le soy honesto. Deberíamos de ir un poquito más lento, pero... Si yo voy más lento, el problema está en que cuando lleguen al intermedio, se me van a asustar. Uh -huh. Entonces, sí, no, no. Mejor los presiono ahorita. Ahorita que se puede y que hay tiempo, como para algo no quedó claro, pues lo, lo repasamos de nuevo y no hay problema. En intermedio se supone que las bases tienen que estar bien establecidas y que usted, you need to be able to, to, to overcome those things easily. Usted se supone que todo eso lo tiene que sobrevivir fácilmente. Entonces, es better now that we can fix it. Es mejor ahorita que tenemos el tiempo para arreglarlo. And not later that it's going to be harder. Y no después que le va a costar más. Because the topics are going to be more difficult. Yeah. Porque los temas van a sí, ser sí. difíciles. Ok, I need you to check the Zoom chat. Necesito que cheque el chat de Zoom. Mm -hmm. Ok. Eh, necesito que guarde ese enlace, that link. Okay. Something interesting there, algo interesante ahí es que usted va a encontrar no solo las reglas, sino que también cómo se pronuncia y audio. Y el audio. Ah, ok. Ok, ok. Ok, now, en eso yo le recomendaría que you need to take into an account something. Necesita ser consciente de algo. You work, you study English, you have your university, you have your family. No le dedique, si le va a dedicar tiempo extra a esto, no more than 10 minutes, no más de 10 minutos. Okay. Whatever you study more than 10 minutes, it's a waste. Lo que usted haga que se pase los 10 minutos va a ser un desperdicio. Mm -hmm. Because you have many things in your mind. So if you got to get more, I mean, you will get just a little bit. Se le va a quedar muy poquito. So better get a little bit. ¿Por qué? Porque si usted está viendo mucho y trata de entenderlo y lo entendió en el momento, pero mañana se le olvidó porque hay muchas cosas en el día a día, se me puede frustrar. Mejor. Ok. Little bit, but steady. Poquito, pero constante. Pero constante, exacto. That's better. Sí. Okay. Mm -hmm. Bueno, okay. espero que eso le sirva, no le entretengo más. I know you are. <risa> Ay, no, qué terrible. And <risa> sí. Any doubt, cualquier duda, please let me know. I'm here to help. Estoy acá para ayudar. Ok, muchas gracias. No, my pleasure. Mm -hmm. Good night. Good night.
Well, time has come. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow.